Yeah. Here we are again. Good morning, everyone. Another stress test. Better angle. Better angle up here. You don't see my double chin. <laughs> The appointment is over. It's only nine o'clock. Our appointment was at eight o'clock. We're already done. Um, I ordered a couple of nursing gowns from Walmart and they were in like Wednesday. So we're gonna stop and pick those up. Probably get us something to eat somewhere because I'm starving. And everything was good. She passed. No issues this time. I mean, they just hooked me up to the monitors and left the room. And then when she came back in, she just looked and she's like, all right. So, so no, she didn't have to get buzzed this time. Last time she had to get buzzed. And I think the first time she had to get buzzed. But <clears throat> now they, this woman said delivery at 39 weeks. So we'll see. So even if they do deliver at 39 weeks, what is that? 20 something? calendar but it all depends on you know how she responds to her non-stress tests my blood pressure um, her fluid levels and how big she is I think that was the factors so um let's see what is so that be the 24th I think she's going to be here on the 17th, though. I keep saying that. I don't know, but I feel like she'll be here on the 17th. On the 17th. But even if we get to the 17th, and i got to wait a week, that's just a week. It's not like it's two weeks or three weeks. I can wait that long. I just want to make sure she's good and healthy and, you know, at a good birth weight and can leave the hospital, like, the next day. <sighs> so... Yes, getting closer and closer. Good thing, because I'm getting bigger and bigger. I have a lot of swelling. I notice I have a lot of swelling in my face. I have swelling in my ankles. I have swelling everywhere. That's just a part of it. You already went in there and spent all your money. Yeah. How much money did you have? $25. You spent $25 yes. on that? For three For what? For three days I got $25. That's a rip off. You spent a dollar an hour. You don't have your size. Mm -hmm. Hey guys, we're at Target now. I had to pick up some <laughs> 12 month onesies. What'd you find? I got him. He's $6. I love him. <laughs> so it is now like 3 o'clock, well, 3.10. I came home and I packaged up a few orders and I finished a couple hair bows and put bows on tutus and got more orders and then we just went to the post office to mail them and we got this big box and honestly I have no idea what's in here you can open it it's a huge box <gasps> a ginormous box of diapers! I'm so excited. <laughs> I 
don't know who that's from. There's your daddy bear. I don't know. There's your daddy bears. Can you pull them out? You can do it. Awesome. Here it is. I can say, is it okay? Here is a. Sandra, thank you so much. It's from Sandra Iverson. Thank you. She already got us gifts too. You're so sweet. And now we got diapers. <laughs> And love, I always, with Nathan and Evan, I always use loves. And it was funny because when, um, when I had Nathan, my sister, she was due, I think we should have switched due dates because she was due at the end of September and I was due at the beginning of October. I think my due date was like October 6th and hers was like September 28th. And... I had my son on September 26th, and she had her son on October 3rd. So really, we should just sw switch due dates. But anyway, um, I don't know if they still do this because it's been a long time, but they used to have points. I don't know if they still do that. I don't know. But you would collect the little love points off each diaper pack, and you would send them in and get free stuff. You could get coupons for like diapers and um, or they'd have things that you could pick out that you would get for free. Now this has been over 20, 21 years ago, so 20 years ago, but yeah. And so she would buy loves, I would buy loves. And then when my sister, um, my little sister had her daughter and that was around the same time that I had Evan. So we both were, so it was like another competition between me and my other sister getting the love points and showing off what we got or whatever. But thank you so much for the diapers. And that is just something that you know that we will go through a lot of. It's so awesome, thank you. Hi guys, good evening. It is now later, probably after seven. But we're gonna eat at Palmetto. We just left Burks. I found Sterling a sweatshirt or a little jacket. I'm gonna monogram her initials on. We are home now. It is a little after eight. But this is what, um, when my husband comes home from work, we decided just to run and take the trash out and then go get us a bite to eat because I wasn't cooking anything. <laughs> and so, um, we decided to run by Burks real quick, and then that's where I picked this up. It was $6.99, and Sterling needs a new sweatshirt like this. Um, I got size 14, 16. Just a little tiny bit big on her, but it'll be alright. And it used to come from Target. The only thing, so when we got to check out, I did notice there was a little tiny hole right in there but I'm just gonna patch that up from the inside and then uh, I'm going to monogram her initials on here and probably put a unicorn or something she wants a unicorn on it so somewhere I'm going to put a unicorn but I think it's really cute it's a mint color and because it's Friday I saved a dollar something off this price so can't beat that But I've been down here working while she was doing schoolwork. And now I'm going to continue. And I've got new pajamas. These are... This is one of the nursing gowns that I bought from Walmart.com. That was $8.50, I think. Um, I got two of them. So this is just one of them. And... I'm wearing my bra with it because I don't want these things to open up. <laughs> so, I told Starley, I was like, it'll fit definitely after this big lump is gone. <laughs> so, 
but it is super super cozy normally um, I wash things before I wear them but I just wanted to wear this like so bad because it's so like soft but anyway I'm gonna continue working on a trolls here um, my husband just went down to um, help with his mom because him and his brother take turns and so I'll probably just finish this one and then probably call it a night not work on anything else because tomorrow he's going to go down and sit with his mom probably tomorrow morning afternoon um, and while he's doing that I'll probably just continue to work on stuff and then he's got to go to work tomorrow tomorrow evening he's got to go to work so I'll probably be around the house all day so I can probably get quite a few things done tomorrow you invited us in here and you're not even ready yeah. tell us what you got that's mom Evan brought it from work and he said it was free and give it to you Whoa. Holy smokes. That's gonna be awesome. You'll just have to peel the plastic off of it. Oops. It's like a motorboat. Here's our elf. Can I get any? Shoo! Yeah. Smells like like middle age. Ooh, it's blue and it's slippery. Don't get them in your hair. You need to put your hair's getting in it. Put your hair up first.